Welcome back to YJ and his plant talk. Have you ever bought a certain plant and realised that it doesn't look like what you expected it to be? I'm sure this is not exclusive to aquarium plants, but it's certainly an interesting observation. Let's talk about one of the elephants in the room. Amania senengalaxis versus Amania gracilis. Amania is one of my favourite plants and for the longest time, there has been discussions about how it can be best identified. Now the first argument is that Amania senengalaxis in its emerged form is more prone to having its leaves curl downwards. So being the fake biologist, I did a few experiments and grew some of them emerged. Alright, what you see here is a part of Amania senengalaxis and possibly maybe gracilis. To be honest, I see most of the curl only in the younger, uh, newly converted ones. For example, this one. There is a curl here. But, uh, for the younger shoots, it is barely noticeable. So, for argument number uno, it might be difficult. That is, given that I can identify this as Amania uh, in the first place. Alright, proceeding to argument number two. I have heard that it might be possible to identify them through the colours of the flower. Here is an example of one of the plants. But based on my scholarly research via Google, it says here that floral characteristics do not support this distinction of two separate species. Ouch, so that didn't work out. Which brings me to full circle into the last obvious argument in which that which says that Amania xenengalaxis has curled leaves in the water and are more likely to display a pink coloration uh, in opposition to purple coloration. Now I think this might be the only way to best ID the plant with the highest accuracy. I determined that most of the plants in my tank are xenengalaxis through three observations. First, the size of the stem. It tends to have a smaller, thinner stem. Secondly, it really does droop downward, especially when it is below the canopy and low light. Third, pink to purple colours. Despite the argument that it is mostly pink, when the plants grow out of the water and are close to the light, I have seen a very deep purple, kind of like the Rabina drink or a grape flavoured cough lozenge. Well, don't ask me why the examples seem oddly specific. My two brain cells came up with that. While these three traits are what I can think of, I'm afraid that sometimes Amania Sinan Galaxies may still present strikingly similar outlook as Gracilis. My two cent opinion on this is that it doesn't matter. Just choose the one that better fits your scape.